welcome to the channel okay guys if you saw that thumbnail yes the thumbnail may be cute and vibrant vibrant but your girl is looking a little mm, but girls guys gents anybody and everybody in my transparency i was like listen we not going we not even going to stop we not even going to go past go I just came into the house, jacket still on, coming from putting in them hours at work, okay? Now, lo and behold, here is my package, and I caught myself dead center in opening this girl, okay? And as you can see on Front Street from Go, guys, me opening this package this is going to be from mark jacobs guys yes this is an authentic mark jacobs the taupe mini bag okay i saw this thing running across my phone and i was like okay press press pay now guys you can leave in the comments if you how how much do you think you are a Mark Jacobs girl? Because I know everybody does not um does not like the tote for you know whatever your personal reasons are. And guys, like I say, I'm here for that. Each one of us, we are ourselves, and in saying that each one of us, that just means that we are different. And girls, this is my favorite hat, but we're going to take off the hat because I look a little. The hat is bringing me down in this space. But, girls, if you don't know, I am definitely a hoodie girl. I absolutely love my Aeropost style hoodies. But, girls, back on to the bag. All right? And may maybe I should come out of the jacket, too. Maybe because I'm getting a little hot. I'm getting a little hot. But I want to be as... As honest and as transparent as possible. And guys, like I said, I'm just getting off of work. So your girl being me, I'm trying to judge myself up a little bit so I don't look <laughs> as tired as I really am. But if you are really, really a Marc Jacobs The Tote fan, leave in the comments because I want to know. Because, girls, this, like I said, when I seen this little bag moseying across my screen, I was like, okay. Um, if you have seen my face before and if you have seen any of my videos talking about Marc Jacobs bags, you'll know my last Marc Jacobs bag that I did get. It was um, basically a lilac purple. And, girls, I have a whole nother story for that because... I do still have that bag. I did not send it away in enough time. But in any event, if this is your first time coming by to see this video and you first time seeing my face, let's get into it. Let's talk about it. And that's going to be this situation right here. Girls, do you see? <laughs> yes, please. Yes, please. Do you see this girl in your screen? Now, I, I do not, do not have, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Guys, I bet you don't know why I'm saying wait a minute, wait a minute. This is adorable. This is freaking adorable because of the size. I do not have any Marc Jacobs leather the totes guys in this in this size but why i honest to god i just said wait a minute okay guys this is going to be the strap that comes on here the strap that is on here this hardware is silver as i see right now guys the hardware on here is silver the Please forgive me as I am coughing in this video. But guys, what do, what do I say all the time? Honesty and transparency, okay? Your girl probably needs some water. 
need something to drink. But as you can see, this is the strap that comes on this bag. If you guys are not familiar, this bag was, let's see, let's see. This bag was $325, okay? From Marc Jacobs, guys, this bag was $325. It is leather. Now, I just want to put this tip and tea out here. Do you guys know that Mark Jacobs, Mark, Mark Jacobs, he has worked with on he has worked for on the Louis Vuitton brand for about 20 years. Do you guys know that? If you did know that, okay, great. If you did not know that, hopefully now you know that. Um, and the reason I'm saying that is because inside in in that fact that he has um been working on the louis vuitton brand for over a decade he knows you know the different things that come in that go on with the branding of bags and, and showing of bags guys this is just the dust bag that comes with this this is so cute because the dust bag is gonna be tiny like the bag look at that that's cute but so this situation this bag guys i'm trying to bear with me i'm trying to take all the stuff off of it so everybody can see it like i see it they put it in the screen so i know that you see it inside of this girl it is orange as you can see right here now girls my thing why i'm saying wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute because this undoubtedly do i have any scissors that are currently in my face no i do not have any scissors that are currently in my face so i cannot move this now on the back it has the little tab right here and guys like you know this is um like a soft leather so this bag is leather so this little bag right here in my hand this is 325 dollars now again i want to stress this is a leather bag but what got me like oh no they did not oh no they did not just do what they just did and girls that is going to be this bag is called pink candy or pink candy or candy pink one one or one or the other and i do see some scissors so guys i'm going to take these scissors and i am going to cut this little tab thing off so that doesn't have to annoy me all right but guys, this bag is, again, orange in the middle. There's no pockets. It is literally just the, the tote. Just a little, a tiny, whiny miniature, the tote. I still love it. I want to be clear. I still love it. But I want to be clear and let you realize what I realized. And what I just realized, I'm not here for this. I'm not here for this at all. I love the bag because it is too cute. But, guys, I was not expecting candy pink. Candy pink or pink candy, whatever name they have it, to be the exact. Do you guys see this? Do you see this in your screen? Please, Lord, tell me you see this in your screen. Your eyes are not playing any tricks on you. Your eyes are not playing no tricks on you. This is the tote. Guys, this, is, this color was called Morning Glory. This was called Morning Glory. Inside of here... The inside of here is red. It has a red interior and it has a little pocket. 
okay this is morning glory this bag this was my first leather bag from mark jacobs brand tell me why is this tell me why please somebody tell me why 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 does this look almost identical why does this look almost identical guys this is called candy pink and this is morning glory as i'm looking at it as i'm looking at it i promise you it is only 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 one shade down because if you were not really 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 paying attention you would swear, but damn, that these was the same color. Okay? You would swear that these was the same color. And, like I said, it is only one shade down, guys. One shade down. Now, I feel like that's disrespectful. I just knew in my heart that this was a totally, completely different color. I just knew in my heart that this this bag was this bag and this bag was going to be something totally different. Like I said, guys, this is literally, honest to goodness, this is only, only a shade down. So if you have, if you have the Morning Glory, and I do realize that bag came out and it just, you know, it, it was like really hot and it jumped off the shelves. Um... I love that. I love this for the size. But guys, leave in the comments what you think. I think I think that this bag should be and should have been a few shades lighter. More so to the tune of like this. Girls, do you see this bubblegum pink? If this bag would have been in this bubblegum pink, baby. B, that would have been a situation. That would have been a situation in a whole vibe. And am I still vibing the bag? Yes. But I want to point this out, guys. These fashion houses, these brands, they are getting us over and over and over. And I'm not here for it. Um... This is my first time opening this bag, guys. I opened it with you guys. You see that I look, you know, I, I didn't work the full day of, of, of working, okay? Earning my coins. And I'm a little, see, I got, I'm shaking up stuff in my space. I'm a little taken back by the fact that this is not, that these bags are so, that this bag is so close in color to the other one so guys leave in the comments what you think about this girl but i think she is also cute and my next little video on her is definitely going to be what fits in here or what's in my bag because i will definitely be getting ready to rock this little girl um what do you guys think about this orange interior what do you think about that? Because I don't like that. I don't like the orange inter interior. Not at all. Why couldn't it just been pink? Like, why couldn't it just been pink? Or, I don't know if they. that's like a color block. Because even in the other one, guys, it's red on the inside. I still think that it's, it's a cutie. It is definitely a cutie. Um, But I just was hoping... I really, 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 really was hoping for a, a totally different pink. Not something that's one shade down. Like, and literally, guys, I can say it with, with all honesty. It is literally one shade down. Just one shade down. And let's see. This strap... The strap is quite long. 
It's quite long. It has a, adjusting abilities. So it can adjust to right here. But guys, it's still long. And I say that for all of my short girls. I know that I'm not the only one in the world that's short. But guys, if you don't know it now, you will know. Your girl being me, I'm only five or one. Okay, so I'm a little, I'm a little something. I'm a, I'm a little something out here. I, I pack a powerful punch, but I am definitely, um, a little something. So, I, in saying that, guys, I'm not here for the huge, for the huge straps and things like that because I'm not tall. I'm not that tall. So, yes. But, this is how this girl looks on strap. With the strap on it. I think it's definitely a little vibe. I'm here for the, min the mini part. The fact that it is so petite and little. I think that is cute. Um, that's something this year that is that I am starting to really like and favor. Like I have said in some of my videos guys i at me personally i absolutely like the 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 tote the fact that it says the tote stands out to me and that's part of why i like it i like the bold the bold simplisticness of this because it, it it's one of those things like okay like, one of my friends, she's like, you know, I'm not walking around with a bag that says the tote. And I understand what she means. But for me, that's part of why I like it. Because it's really it's really simple. And it it's just that, that statement. It's really a tote bag. And it really says the tote. <laughs> which, with, which some people was like, okay, that's simple and it's stupid. Um, and... I guess for me, if it was a different design, if it didn't look so basic, um, and maybe if the letters had something else going on and it didn't have this block and the shape that it has, like when I first saw the tote bag by Marc Jacobs, when I first saw it from the very, I want to say guys, um, I've known about this bag and this bag has been the rave, um, for I think for the last for maybe the last two and a half years prior to that this you know if they had made the bag already it it hadn't start started picking up so much traction um I don't know if anyone famous started wearing the bag and that's what made it popular I don't know but I do know everybody and their mama and their cousin and their auntie and their uncle and nephew and whomever um wanted to at some point acquire one of these bags and if they don't already have one they are trying to get one um for whatever their reasons are i definitely believe that our reasons for getting a bag is not the same but i personally like it because i think not just because the trend i like the shape i like the shape of the bag i like the style of the bag and I, too, like the fact that it says the tote. Um, and in that, I have realized that I like the... What do I want to call this? The bag, the bags that resemble this actual bag. I, if, if, you're, if you're not familiar with my channel and this video finds you for the first time, I do have videos up of other... Um, the tote bags that are um like renditions of this bag and i think that they are a whole vibe as well um and just like purchasing this guys i have the authentic ones the authentic bags i am here for them as well some some of the Marc Jacob bags that are basically like the knockoffs or what have you some of them are polar trash um, I have been fortunate. I have been fortunate to not really get those. I did do a review on 
Uh, I have two or three The Bucket bags, and I'm really not a fan because the Bucket bags that I do have, guys, from Marc Jacobs, they are, um, they, they are, I guess, lookalikes or what have you, and no, 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 those are not good lookalikes, but guys, leave in the comments what you think about this girl i think that it is a i think that is a vibe it's definitely a vibe i'm definitely going to be wearing it but i was very thrown off by the fact that it is honest to goodness it is only one shade and i dare anybody else to get on the color wheel it's, it's one shade down from the um morning glory it's literally when you pair these bags together you will see you have to do a double take and you have to ask yourself you literally gonna be asking yourself do you need glasses um or you know is something going on with your vision because on one hand you look at it and you like they look identical then you look at it again and you like okay you see you see that the morning glory is a little bit richer that's what you realize it's a little bit richer in its pigment of the pink now this candy pink or pink candy whichever way that phrase goes it is honest to god is one shade down so for the for the money and for the fact of having another pink bag like come on let's do better let's do better like okay okay so guys leave in the comments what you think about it I feel some type of way about it. I really do. I do have it. Am I sending it back? No, I'm not sending it back. I'm keeping it. But in that regard, I was a little disappointed. Like I showed you the Kate Spade bag. I feel like it should have been a totally, completely brand new pink. Not something that's one little shade down. No, give, give me 10 shades down. Give me 15 shades down. Like give me, give me something that's totally another color for my money like don't give me something that's smaller and i'm paying 325 dollars for the exact same thing because if i wanted the exact same thing then i could I, give me the choice to because like i said like now i'm kind of rambling guys but um my thing is i i think that is all a marketing is all a marketing thing and you know that's how you get that that's how they steal our coins and i'm not here for nobody taking my coins because i love pink i do love pink undoubtedly but i'm not here to get got unnecessarily and i and i feel like a little bit um a little bit i i, I really i really got taken <laughs> I got really, I really got taken for some of my coins. So, girls, leave in the comments what you think. And your girl being me, I am going to be out because I am tired. Okay? So, me being honest and transparent, I just came into the house and I was like, listen, I need to make this video. I want to put this video out. I want everybody to know about this bag. Okay? So, until the next time, guys, bye for now.